here we are measuring the Apache Tech light with a 955 meter reading of uh, photosynthetic photon flux, which basically is the, uh, the readings of the proper wavelength of creating photosynthesis for plants. So at, at one foot away, we're at 950, 948, 950. And so that's good. Let's turn that one off and turn the stealth on. Here's a self 600 watt. Uh, they're using 300 2 watt LEDs. And we're at 869, 870. So between 869, 870 micromoles uh, at one foot away. They're consuming in, uh, over 300 watts of electrical uh, consumption as opposed to. The Apache Tech 120 watt, which consumes about 156, 157 watts of energy. So more powerful, half the electricity. Yes. So now what we're going to do is we're going to go over to a 600 watt metal halide. And the meter reading is 389, 390, 400. 411, 416. So with the brightest that we got on that was 416 on a 600 watt metal halide. So, and, and just to let you know what we're doing is PAR is a photosynthetically active radiation. This is the wavelength of light measured as irradiance that are most active in photosynthesis. And that would be the wavelength between 400 nanometers, which is violet, up to 700, and 700 nanometers, which is near red and far red. Um, and the meter that we're using is a quantum meter. It says uh, photosynthetic photon flux. Basically, uh, that is a primary. That is a primarily a measurement where it has moles of quanta in the wavelength region between the 400 and 700 nanometers. Uh, and this uh, this is involved in, with the photosynthesis. The amount of photosynthesis or the plant productivity is directly proportionate to the amount of quanta, which is the energy absorbed by the plant. So now we're going to head over to a third LED. Now this was five. This one, what they have is they have five watt LEDs on this one. And on this one, at a foot away, we have 203 micromoles. 204. So that was 204. So there we have it. And you can see that they've got nice four little plants in this four by four grow chamber. So compared to the Apache Tech 120 which out, outputs a lot uh, a lot more than this LED so it's, uh, it's it's quite easy to see that being the Apache Tech being designed for the uh, NASA to NASA standards uh, it, it's far superior than the other lights And you can see the, the wavelength of color is a little bit more of an orange. Um, the light spectrum is specifically designed for, for growing and uh, fruiting all types of plants and vegetables. And we're conducting this test here at WeGrow in Oakland, California.